Hello everyone, it's Reza Red. Um, if you haven't heard, uh, today uh, Power BI, new version of Power BI Desktop has been released uh, with a lot of interesting features and one of these interesting features is Q&A in reports. Previously we've been able to use Q&A in dashboards, now we can use Q&A in creating Power BI reports. So, so let's check it out and see how it is working. Uh, for using Q&A in reports, first you have to download the latest version of Power BI Desktop. Uh, if you are using Windows 10, I highly recommend using um, Microsoft Windows uh, Store and downloading Power BI Desktop from there because it will out, uh, update automatically in next few versions. Uh, so if, after downloading your Power BI Desktop, you have to go to File, Options and Settings, Options. Uh, Q&A is right now preview feature uh, released as of today. Go to the preview features section, find the Q&A and select it. After selecting it and pressing OK, it will ask you to close your Power BI desktop and open it again. Uh, because I have already done that, so I don't need to open it again. Now I have a uh, Power BI data set here, which I can start creating report by just asking a question. After enabling this feature, you will see uh, this option to uh, to ask a question in home tab ask a question you can click on it simply and start asking question I can ask sales amount it shows me sales amount I can say sales amount by English education it shows me sales amount by English education. That's how easy it is to create a chart. I can create another chart and say sales amount by English education and gender. It basically creates a bar chart for me and I can say as column chart. This basically makes it column chart. There, there are heaps of uh, things that you can create with this calculation, uh, with this actually way of asking, um, like sales amount by English occupation as pie chart. So as you can see, I can simply create my whole report by asking a question. And when you create that, this will, uh, when you ask a question, this will create the section for access legion values based on how you ask your question. So very simple to configure, very easy to use. Uh, it is preview right now, but it is going to be released, I believe, uh, fairly soon. It's one of the most interesting features added recently in Power BI Desktop. As you have seen, this was a very interesting feature in Power BI Desktop. Um, every month there are new updates coming. Uh, always check new Power BI Desktop features and please subscribe to your YouTube channel to learn more about Power BI.